Okay, um, hello YouTube. My father and I have a, uh, an estate sale hoard. Apparently, the gentleman who passed away worked, uh, well, he was a soldier under Patton. And so, we've got a whole bunch of one marks. And they're all looking to be in what condition would you say, Dad? The one marks. Mm, fine. Fine? <laughs> you didn't call him AU? No. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, that's British right there. Mm. Foreign. Now, what do we got over here? What are these guys? These are still one mark. Just trying to get all the one marks in a row. Now, these are five, three, three marks. Yeah, these are all three marks. Yeah. Um, Dry marks. So, let's take a look at each one. So, I'm going to have to look and see if there's any key dates in here. But they all look to me to be in pretty darn good shape. See some Kaisers in there, right? This one is really pretty. The 1914. And then we got just some various silver here, right? Some dimes. It's a Russian Kopec, I guess, from 1932. And a bunch of half and one marks. So pretty good deal, right? Alright. Thanks for showing those, Dad. And thank you, YouTube, for watching okay, the video. Okay, hello, YouTube. I had some really cool things that my mom and dad have from the lovely Dresden, Maine on a beautiful day. So we first got a Holly Selassie medallion in bronze. Can you show it a little bit, Dad? No talk, don't touch it like that. You're gonna you're gonna get your hand oils on it. So what, what, can, what can you tell us about this beautiful 1967, medallion? and it's bronze, and it's pretty well mint in the yeah. box it came in. Very shiny bright. So um, how did you get a hold of this thing? What, uh, where did you find it? I have no idea. You're I supposed to was... tell an exotic story about finding it in Africa. Yeah. Well, maybe I did. I mean, we did I, go. It's probably a trip. I had one trip to Chad. Maybe it's from there. Or... The Belgian Congo back then. Okay. I did get a couple trips to Africa. All right, well, let's talk about this Pope Pius one. Is it Pope Pius, or who is it? Well, it's the three Pope Pius. This is Pope Pius number 9, 10, and 12. It's the three popes. It's gold-plated. And, and how long have you had it? Oh, I would say 30 years. Okay. I and bought it down at, at an auction in Maryland. Okay. But it's gold plated. It's beautiful. They had 1954 and it's pretty mint. I thought you might have had a great story on that one too. Oh well. No, just auction. Okay. An auction fine. So if I were to find a buyer for either one of these, you might be willing to part with them? Yeah, because I'm not that partial to the Pope and I'm not <laughs> a Haile Selassie fan. Well, I don't think the Pope or Haile Selassie are too partial to you either after that <laughs> comment, but that's okay. Well, maybe. All right. Well, I'll tell you what, then. I'm going to go ahead and see what, what kinds of friends out there. I think 24K might like Holly Selassie. He's into 20, into that. And then we got a couple guys down in uh, Florida who might like this. Or maybe Tiago Da Silva might like it. I got a couple uh, friends that, that, that aren't as uh, um, anti-papal um, who might just like it. So we'll see what we can do for you. Good luck. All right. Thank you very much, Sandlins. And, uh, and thanks for also showing those great German coins you got at the estate sale. Over Let's and out. See, so. Hello YouTube, it's Delroy BPM. And uh, sorry well, I haven't been posting uh, any videos lately. As many of you know, I am um, uh, ended my contract in Kuwait last, uh, I guess, two months ago now. And I'm looking like crazy for another well, job. Well, so, uh, hint, hint, any of you know anybody who needs a hardworking guy, let me know. I think my parents are ready for me to go find something. So, these coins, that's my mom laughing here. <laughs> so, um, these coins here uh, went into an estate sale looking for a lawnmower and a Nedge. And I found yeah, these instead. So, um, uh, to my my um, friends uh, and uh, who go to estate sales, I got lucky for the first time, really. So, yeah, these German, uh, Prussian, and these uh, uh, German states coins uh, all were really in MS or AU shape. They haven't been out of these coin flips in a long time, I don't think. 
Um, the guy, before he passed away, had put down some prices. Um, you know, so got a very good deal on those, and hopefully my father will enjoy them. He's already got a pretty big German collection from uh, when he used to fly there in the Air Force. So um, coming up, there's going to be some most, more close-ups on the uh, papal um, token that's for sale and the Halle Selassie token that's for sale. I'm hoping that um, some of you out on YouTube would like to make some offers to my dad. Uh, you could use a little bit of uh, um, some money. <laughs> and uh, these aren't uh, coins that we're really specializing in. The Vatican uh, token uh, that you'll see is gold-plated. And then the Halle Selassie, and they're both silver. The Halle Selassie, I'm sorry, the Halle Selassie is a, a copper token. But um, um, it's really beautiful. Um, so anyway, we're really happy with these, uh, all these German coins that we got. Really got lucky on them. And uh, as you can see, uh, most of them are in pretty good shape. So thanks for checking out the video, everybody at YouTube. And I'm hoping to hear maybe back from 24K on the Holly Selassie. And um, who knows, maybe uh, Tiago de Silva um, might be interested in the papal... Uh, token. If not, please PM me and let me know if you are interested. So anyway, enough talk. Enjoy the rest of it, and uh, thank you for checking out my That's video. Russian one. This roll book in here. You in action. For Carson Wentz. And Crowell. Jackson is right here. And he. So anyway, Frank Pinus Maddox, uh, maybe you'd like that papal token. And I uh, kind of got thinking of you when I was at that. Um, estate sale and now I went to about 30 or 40 garage sales and estate sales and I haven't found anything except for some very overpriced stuff so anyway Frankie P um, hopefully you'll like them and then 24k or Tiago if you guys like the Holly Selassie coin please get back to me right away I don't think they'll they'll last long and we'd like to um, uh, sell them we need a little bit of revenue or some some money uh, for short-term stuff so um, not selling much in the collection, but a couple things here and there that uh, would be nice. So please get a hold of me. You guys know how to get a hold of me. And uh, that's about it. I do have one other thing to show you that I found in the closet, um, actually in the attic. So that's coming up uh, a little bit further in the video. So thanks for checking out the pickups.
So found these in the attic. Uh, my dad and mom gave this to me, I guess when I was about eight or nine years old. For Franklin Mint, these are silver rounds and uh, they sat on my windowsill in my, 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 uh, in my um, room for years and years and years. So thanks mom and dad. Two. You're welcome.